The Boxer, 1997 film starring Daniel Day-Lewis and Emily Watson, a drama about the Irish Troubles with touches of romance and sports sprinkled in. It's set in Belfast during the strenuous times of the Troubles, um, towards the end of it all. As the film opens, we find the leadership of the IRA in Belfast in disagreements. There is a faction working towards a ceasefire and peace with the Protestants, but there is also a strong faction that wants to continue their fight, continue you know, committing acts of terrorism, basically, despite the casualties that, that may be involved. In the midst of it all, Danny Flynn, played by Daniel Day-Lewis, gets released after 14 years in prison. He's a boxer that had his own ties to the IRA in the past, which is slowly revealed in the story. Upon his release, he wants to try and rebuild his life, moves into his former apartment, tries to reconcile with a former lover, played by Emily Watson, and restarts a gym for young people where they can train. But his refusal to get cozy with the IRA um, people and his stubborn insistence on having the gym be a sort of neutral ground of sorts, where people from both sides of the, of the barricade, the conflict, can come in, um, means that things are sure to heat up and escalate. So I think what the film does really well is take a look at the troubles, not from a macro perspective as a historical chain of events, but rather on a small scale everyday, you know, it looks at the small scale everyday impact of it all on the people that lived there. We watched the conflict through the eyes of those people impacted by it. And that's, you know, both those involved directly in the conflict and those who want nothing to do with it, but are forced to, to live with the consequences. I think that perspective um, grounds the drama and humanizes it. It's, it's a very personal film thrown onto the grander background of the troubles. Um, I think it's very well written uh, with complex characters who have layers and reasons for being who they are and doing what they do. You believe that they are all real people. You buy into the film because of that. Um, it's acted out very well too. I think it's one of the more quiet and subtle performances by uh, Daniel Day-Lewis. He plays the role in a very subdued way and you can sort of see the weight of his past on his shoulders in every scene he's in. He's also believable from a purely physical perspective. Apparently, he trained for three years for the role with a real boxing coach as a consultant, and that guy later said that when filming the movie, Day-Lewis was on such a good level, he could have easily boxed professionally with success. I also want to highlight Emily Watson, who is sort of the emotional heart of the story. With Day-Lewis's slightly detached and quiet demeanor, it is sort of on her to be the conduit for the for the unspoken and spoken feelings between them, and she does that job admirably. Finally, I have to say the movie comes alive through the way it looks. It was shot mainly on location, although in Dublin and not Belfast, but the locations chosen for filming do a terrific job of transporting the audience into that specific time and place, into the shoes of the characters. So, if you haven't seen The Boxer, do give it a chance. I think it's a very good, very mature, yet human portrayal of what life meant for the people in the tragic circumstances of the Irish Troubles.